That was Gotham Knights, and now we welcome. Oh, oh. Is. Neil Druckmann. Yes. From Naughty Dog. Uh, okay. From Naughty Dog. Okay. Uh, Let's nice go. Us, Neil, it's been a uh, an eventful day on the internet for Naughty Dog fans, we, and uh, yes, we, we jinxed ourselves. We were joking about last night, like watch the ass assets leak, and yes. lo and behold. <laughs> That's what yes, well, the good yes, news yes. Is there's some stuff that hasn't leaked that we have lots to share with people about uh, all things at Naughty Dog. But first of all, it is a you know it's a big month actually for Last of Us fans because uh, okay. Last of Us One and Two both launched in June and it's nearing its two year anniversary for Last of Us uh, Part Two, which is is hard to hard to believe. Yes. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, um, you know, nine years for Last of Us One, two years for Last of Us Part Two. Just show the game, please. Just They're show the game. Letters and <laughs> art and these characters and this journey and this world means so much to them. Um, yeah, and it's it's just been kind of amazing. Like last was part two early this year. God, That's I'm about to cry, and I didn't even see the game units. yet. And that kind of support, that kind of success, um, we're so grateful to our fans. It has allowed us to grow as a studio, and now we can take on multiple projects more than we've ever had at the same time. Oh, okay. Multiple projects. Okay. Yes. Very interesting. <laughs> so, uh, what can last of, us, last of Us fans expect in the future from you? Yes. Thank you for asking, Jeff. Yes. Uh, so one of the things we've mentioned a while back is what started out as a multiplayer mode has evolved yes. into team's ambition. Yes. Something beyond what we've ever done before at Naughty Dog. And we felt the way to do it justice is to make it a standalone title. And over the, Ooh, they've been working on it for the past two years. Yes. The ambition has grown. And we're not quite ready to fully unveil it, but we're ready to lift okay. the curtain a little bit and just give you like an update of where we're at. Okay. okay, well, uh, what can you tell us about this new standalone multiplayer game? Yeah, so uh, we have a concept art that we want to show. Yeah. Um, the concept art? Uh, but what, what I can tell you there oh. is that this game is big. Okay. Um, it's as big okay. as any of our single player games that we've done, and in some ways bigger. It's got a story. Um, the way we're okay. telling that story is very unique to this game. Um, it's got a brand new cast of characters. It takes place at another cool. place, uh, another part of the United States. It's like a okay. city might be somewhat familiar to some people. I'm sure our fans have already figured it out. Um, Is uh, that New York? It's, it's, it's really cool. And it's being headed by Vinith Uggerwal, um, Anthony Newman, and uh, Joe Padnatti, all veterans of Uncharted and Last of Us. And you're going to see a lot more of this game come next year. Next oh, year. So wait till next okay. year to hear more about that yeah. one. Okay, well, very exciting that uh, this has evolved, and I mean, that concept art looks incredible. I can't wait to see yes. Naughty Dog storytelling fused with multiplayer live game. Yes, uh, it's, right. it's something special. I, we can't wait to show it either. Okay, okay. well, um, that's not all. We also have something that I've been reading about on the internet every day, it feels like, up in <laughs> Calgary. They're filming the Last of Us show for HBO, yep. right? You gonna show that? Yeah, so uh, for the past year, um, you know, we've teamed up with Craig Mazin of Chernobyl fame and HBO to adapt The Last of Us into a TV uh, TV show. Um, yes. They've been filming, and uh, it's pretty incredible. The stuff I'm getting back when we're looking at back at Naughty Dog, we can't help but feel emotional because not only is it so good and the quality is so high, it's so authentic to what we've made in the game. Okay. Um, and that's good to hear uh, from the guys I, I just that made the game. I'm really proud of, like again, Craig and that whole crew and everybody that's up there. Uh, and they're actually their last day of filming is tomorrow. So the entire series, oh, last day of filming is tomorrow. Last day of filming is tomorrow. Okay. Is up there right now, kind of wrapping it all up. So can you, uh, can you so it's, it's show us cool. anything? It's closer than you might think. And you actually got to direct one of the episodes. Yes, uh, I think that really speaks okay. to the kind of collaboration and trust that exists between Naughty Dog and HBO. They invited me to direct one of the episodes. That's um, dope. I think we have an image from the episode I actually directed. Oh, an right. image. Right. first look. Just Let's an take. image. Uh, wow. So you can see uh, this is a certain museum that yep. players might know from the game. <gasps> um, and I really have to talk about Pedro Pascal <laughs> and Bella Ramsey and not only directing them but seeing them do all the other episodes. They've thrown themselves at these roles um, for a whole year. Watching oh. the nuance that they bring to these characters, their relationship on and off camera, I couldn't help but think about Troy Baker and Ashley Johnson. It felt so oh. similar to the chemistry yeah. those two actors had when we made the game. Um, and it really feels like this is going to be something special. And I, okay. I will say this will be the most authentic video yeah. game adaptation yet. Well, I mean, that first image okay. that they put out, it just, I mean, it feels like the video game. Everything that I've seen, this both feels like the video stuff, game is dark as hell. Sort of but super it, legitimate, as you said, and that's Jesus awesome Christ. to see uh, Joel and Ellie from, from the front side now for the first time. Um, so we'll see more of that at next year that's coming as well, right, Sirius? Uh, you'll hear about it very soon. That's, that's okay. all I'll say right now. All, all right. Okay. Well, Last of Us HBO, very, very exciting. Uh, and I hear you actually have a couple actors from the show who are uh, 
going to join we us here? We happen to have a couple actors here that are part of the show. We should bring them up. Okay. Oh. Oh, what's up, guys? Oh, hello. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> Troy's back again. Hello. I know. Yes. Oh, hi. Good to see you. Uh, yes. I'm a little confused, though. I, I thought maybe... Pedro Bella, but Troy Ashley out here uh, from the game, right? So uh, yes. when Craig and I started working on the show, almost one of our very first meetings, we said, Troy and Ashley have to be a part of it. Um, and we're such fans of like the talent and the help, like helping us create Joel and Ellie. Um, we felt like it was so important that they become part of the show. And it wasn't, it's, it has to be more than just like, kind of like a wink to the camera and like a cameo. Okay. These uh, are okay. real roles that we're keeping on the wraps for now. Uh -huh. uh, okay. But man, I was, I'm bummed that I couldn't be there with you guys when you filmed your stuff. There's been so much it's stuff so, I feel like so good <laughs> on the internet. There's so much like talk about what's being filmed, and I think that's you guys have kept a complete secret that you do up there cool. and you've, you've filmed your roles by now. Obviously, uh, well, keeping yeah. secrets yeah. with this franchise is kind of old hat. Like we've except had except for today, except for today. It was it was one of the hardest things for us to do is to let not let people know that because we're so proud of it and the work that we did. We worked hard. The the crew. I have to say. Um, when I walked out on set, um, to be met with literally every person that I met on that crew uh, is such a fan of this game, and they all knew what it was that they were working on and committed to working on this project because of their fan and their love for the for the game uh, was one of the greatest. It was like I was coming home to friends. Cool. Yeah, I, I the attention to detail, the crew was amazing. Bella and Pedro are man. I. <laughs> They're so perfect, and it, it, we, we've been trying to sort of describe that feeling of sort of seeing them in person. It's, it's, like, it's like the characters coming to life, but it, it, it's so much more than that. I feel like I can't fully explain it, but I am so excited to be a part of it, and just I can't wait to see it. I think it is going to be uh -huh. so good. It's, it's, so I love the story. I love... No, just I, being I'm, a part of I'm so world. excited about the series and the fact that you guys are going to be in it and undisclosed yes. world. I'm so fascinated how it's going to sort of bob and weave and, and, you know, are these characters we know from the game that they're playing? New characters? Can you tell us anything? <laughs> yes. Mm. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. You. So sneaky. All right. Well, we're so excited. Maybe to, it's to already on Twitter by now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Well, let's talk about what was on Twitter earlier. Uh, yes. Today. Lots of talk yes. About, uh, yes. Idea. But really what's happening is it looks like you guys are remaking the original game. And this is like a ground up remake. Is that right? That's right. Uh, we wanted to give ground people the definitive remake. version of the, the first game that wasn't encumbered by any technology. Uh, wanted to find uh -huh. a way to get even closer to our original vision. Uh, and we're able to do it on the PS5 and PC. And instead of talking about it, let's look at it. All right, let's take a <gasps> let's look go. at the Let's go. Last let's go. Us. Let's go. So why'd you leave Boston? Oh, my God. I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. Uh-huh. All oh, this office. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. That doctor, that... He's got everything to do with that little girl. Yep. Oh, my God. Yep. 9 to you know, 22 I've never been this close. It's the outside. So is that everything you hoped for? Oh, my God. It, it can't be so any good. worse out there. Yep. Yes, you can. <laughs> Can it? Yes, it can. Once upon a time, love story. I had somebody that I cared oh, about. This is... And in this world, that's good for one thing. Get you killed. Left behind. I can take care of myself. How many close calls have we had? Uh-huh. I get in trouble down there. You make every shot count. Yep. I got this. Yep. Oh, yes. You know how to use that thing. Had <laughs> some practice. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. The Last of Us Part One. Yes. <laughs> Truly let's one of my go. favorite games of the past decade, guys. Wh what's your reaction to that? <sighs> yeah, we uh, hadn't seen that yet. Yeah, you're watching it in oh real my time. God. Yeah. Uh, it's because you did these. I mean, these performances you did a decade ago. Yeah. You didn't go back yeah. in. I mean, you used the original performances. Yeah, right? actually, we we came up with a process where you could take the original 
uh, animation that we did for the faces and okay. kind of like retargeted on these new rigs that have a lot more fidelity. Oh my and God. then the animators went back and We're studied. side by oh. side here just how much it has changed that you went and you redid the models and rebuilt everything? Everything was re uh, rebuilt from the ground oh up. My God. Uh, same art director, re-art directed the whole thing from the ground up. Um, Bro, but look but at the this. The great thing about these faces is that um, they're closer to the original performance. Our, all the animators went and studied those videos and got it closer to what you did on set than we could have achieved before. Oh my God. Um, and that's just like one of the things um, we could talk about, like this brand new AI, like all the combat is, like, is, is redone. Um, just uh, the fidelity of everything, 60 frames per second, all the stuff you're getting on the cry, PS5. Bro. Again, we wanted to give, knowing because of the show, because this, they're all, all new players for PS5 and PC, yeah. we wanted them to have the definitive version of The Last of Us. Okay. Amazing. Well, now you guys get to. That's dope. I mean, when was the last time you guys played the game? Yesterday. <laughs> I, I actually played it again just to refresh my memory the before show? working uh -huh. on the show. Uh -huh. um, okay. I was a just a glutton for punishment, and I went straight from playing uh, yeah, part never one it. straight into <laughs> part two. Um, and so the last time that I played literally would have been two years ago since we're celebrating oh. the anniversary of part two coming out. So, I mean, it looks like I'm definitely going to be up for another yeah, playthrough I can't, with I, mean, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to go back. It was oh, I can't a, wait. Uh, you guys did such an amazing job on that original game. and yeah. it's, it's really when you play it, when you see it in motion, it's really yeah. night and day from what, what it used to be. So I imagine that, you know, the, think of The Last of Us 2 combat, but kind of that back in The Last of Us 1. Well, it's the uh, whole, like, all the yeah. new animation system, the new AI system, everything we've learned on, like, Uncharted 4, Last of yeah. Us 2, we apply to mm -hmm. this, wow. again, to uh -huh. get that definitive version. Just to give a quick shout-out, uh, this project is headed up by uh, Matthew Gallant and Shauna Sky. Okay. Uh, okay. And you'll hear a lot more about it and see a lot more about it over the coming weeks leading up to the release September 2nd on PS5. Okay. All right. And shortly nice thereafter on PC. We will look forward to it. Now, you, Neil, you've talked a lot about games directed by other people what, what are you directing you still making games still making games okay. uh, i haven't okay. given up my, my day job uh it's a little early to talk about it maybe if someone in place and wants to leak it then we can yeah. talk about it now <laughs> uh, otherwise, uh, we'll save but it. you do have a new project do have a new project okay. uh, but we'll save it for another summer game fest okay <laughs> oh, okay okay well we'll see we'll try and save it all right <laughs> troy ashley bill thank you so much for dropping by summer game fest and i am so excited that the last of us is returning as you said in september yes so thanks guys appreciate awesome. it thanks jeff awesome